welcome to my channel. On this channel, sustainability matters. We focus on natural fiber. In fact, my current mantra on this channel is fabric, fit, and style, which means that we find sustainability very sexy. So, thank you so much guys for joining me and I definitely hope that you continue to do so and watch my videos for the new year. So, happy holidays guys. So today I'll be showing you some looks that I have put together for your inspiration. This first look is one of the most basic pieces that you would often get as a Christmas present during the holiday season and I am going to show you how to spice it up. For me, I love bold colors so this is definitely not working for me just yet but my first step was to add a really bold piece and that's my bag. That's a piece from Rebecca Minka. It's 100% leather. I love the contrast against just this plain template that we are starting with today. So for those of you who love neutral colors, this is definitely one way to start. Another way that you can zhuzh it up a bit if you definitely want to stay with the neutral palette is to add another neutral piece. And this is where my Dolce & Gabbana belt comes in. It's definitely a great piece to show your outfit up. For me, I love colors and this is definitely within my comfort zone. So I've added this aqua blue cami top. It's definitely a night wear, but I wear it as a cami top and it's an excellent color to upgrade your pajama bottoms and give it a really great holiday look. This is an outfit that you can wear to a sit down dinner with the family and with guests around. You can of course tuck it in. I love it either way. I find it looks elegant either way. It's just the jewel tone of this piece that really upgrades the look for me. Added to that is the bag that I'm also pairing with it. As you guys have seen in the last video, this is a piece by Steve Madden. It's 100% leather. It's an excellent Bottega Veneta dupe and I love how beautifully it pairs with this outfit. So if you do love colors, you can add your reds or your yellows or mustards, whatever color you love. This is an excellent way of upgrading your pajama piece. One of the looks I'll be sharing with you is this kimono piece. This was a bestseller at Zara. And looking at it from this side, you may not recognize it, but I wanted to just bring this to your attention because I have used this several times in my videos and it's a piece that is very versatile and I've recently discovered that it can be worn on both sides and I never knew that until now. So I'll incorporate it into some of my looks and share the different ways in which I have styled this particular piece. So this is one way in which I've added and incorporated the kimono piece to this look. If you want to upgrade your pajama trend, just add a kimono in the same color tone and you're good to go. Sorry to interrupt guys, but just a quick note. Hi guys! If you just so happen to just click on my video, you are new, please click the red subscribe button. So here they are guys, if you click on these buttons, you'll be part of my channel and you'll be notified when I post new videos. And most importantly guys, it's free.
thank you so much for subscribing love you let's get back to the video for me this is an excellent way to upgrade the pajama look i find it very elegant very classy and if you're conscious of your upper arms or any part of your upper body a kimono is an excellent choice not only is it elegant but it's comfortable and it hides your perfect imperfections so this for me is a no-brainer i wear a kimono at every opportunity i get because i love the elegance of it so definitely one of my favorite options and of course you know me or you should know me by now i am into double belting so another way that i have upgraded the pajama look is to double belt it so again i've incorporated my dolce and gabbana belt any belt that you have in your closet would work just as beautifully if you have any belts with interesting details like a great or a different or a unique buckle it's a great place to start something with a fringe would also work just as beautifully for me double belting is a no-brainer and i find it makes a look look very runaway and i love the runaway type of look so just add a belt guys or two or even three for that matter another interesting detail i've added is this stiletto shoe it's a great pop of red at the bottom and it's an unexpected addition to this piece because who would have thought of adding red with browns and aquas and nudes so it's my way of color blocking and i am just loving it i love the pop of floral green as you go by i think it's such a great look really love this piece and here i know here i am again just shuffling things up a bit for me a belt could get boring on the sides or in the middle and even if i'm double belting i still like to add my twist to it so here i'm putting the belts at the back the buckles <laughs> yeah just for an interesting look and i am trying to figure out how best i like it do i love it on the sides or at the back and for me it really doesn't matter as long as it gives me the look that i'm going for and that is the runaway or an upgrade look to the pajama trend you can definitely add your favorite necklaces these are mine and i love how well they pair beautifully and pull the outfit together and you guys have seen how beautifully the aqua blue paired with this pajama bottom so i've added my favorite christmas green top this is an absolutely great piece it's such a rich green it really really works with this piece i love the way it looks it's a polyester piece and as you guys know yeah polyester and i don't get along very well but here are some tips and tricks of how to deal with your synthetic items that you have in your closet for this look i wanted to go back to my caribbean roots when i was tucking my blouses on both sides so i really wanted to bring this little trick into this look and i actually love it i haven't done this for ages 
I think it works really well and if you do have some extra cakes and food it could work for you as well as here again is the kimono as you know it as you have seen me worn it on several occasions so I am just wearing it as is and I don't think I have to say anything else because it works well on both sides for me and this for me is a great piece that I would have to wear in my closet and get my cost per wear for years to come I really hope you enjoyed these looks guys I really had fun putting them together and my goal is that you look into your closet see what you have and get your pajama pieces to work for you both in the bedroom as well as at a sit down dinner or get together you get inspired and I'll see you in the next one remember to always love yourself and to accept your perfect imperfections because they are what make you unique and drop dead gorgeous love you